Brought to you by Seven Days and sponsored by Hotel Vermont and Vermont Tourism. My name is Eva Solberger. We're here in downtown Burlington at the playground outside of St. Joseph's School for Holy Festival of Colors. Happy Holy! Happy Holy! It's a festival of color, peace, and love. Celebrating the happiness. All the Hindus people, they celebrate this. This is a Hindu festival celebrating spring. Today we have members of the Bhutanese, Indian, and Nepalese communities coming together to celebrate their cultural traditions with an explosion of color. I have three GoPros and I'm going to be filming it. Vermont. Holi is so in line with Vermont values and culture because it's all about renewal, rebirth, celebrating what the earth gives us, celebrating being with each other and being outside. Since we're in America, there's like a lot of people who are from different countries and we get to like, they can experience what we're doing. Holi has, you know, cultural significance to it and a lot of people celebrate with value and it has something very important that we hold on to. Uh, this is not just the throwing color at people. There are hundreds if not thousands of observant Hindus in the Burlington area and beyond coming here mostly as Bhutanese Nepali refugees but there's also other members of the South Asian community who largely live in Chittenden County. A cultural event more than a religious event. Color is just it's a kind of a God bless you kind of thing. It's just a kind of blessings from the God to you. Playing with each other, playing with people who are actually interested to play with us and showing the larger community that we do have a lot of cultural background. When I was growing up, it was a way for me to go out and put colors on other people. And uh, now, after understanding its significance, it is a really good way to bring community together. I like to do this every year. You know, it's been like six, seven years we're doing this here. We marched downtown, and it was really fun. A lot of people were joining us. They were cheering us, and it was really a good way to show the community that there are various different cultures live in this community. From kids to youth, adults, senior. And uh, this year we have respect from Youth and Family Services, who sponsor the event. It's hosted by Vermont Hindu Temple in partnership. It's awesome. It's, it's amazing. Yeah. I think it's really fun. Yeah. It's my first time. I think it's a really good experience. You can see it. There's not just Nepali community here. We have. You know, everybody coming out. Well, I know they have people here from some of the yoga studios, and for them to see this is another dimension of the culture that they draw so much from. You get to splash colors in people's faces, and you get to see your friends and family, and family all yeah. reunited in one place. So that's just that's how it is. Celebrating spring. Yeah, and and it's a good overthrowing people. really important for our new younger generation to know that we have this beautiful festival. That's why we have like small children coming in today. You know we are teaching the values and culture to them. We are very lucky to be living in the state of Vermont. We have recently established an organization in the state of Vermont, Vermont Hindu Temple. Long term goal is to have our own permanent space. A lot of people in, in, in our community now they know that we exist and we have this wonderful uh, festival.
fun. We'll get stuck in Vermont with you again real soon. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. And sign up for our email alert.